Hello everyone, in this video I am going to talk about Facebook Ads Manager, how it looks like on the desktop, how it works on the desktop and how it looks on the Facebook Ads application, how it works on Facebook Ads application. So right now you can see I am on my Ads Manager and uh, right now I have selected this ad account, Fatih Jeans ad account. So here there are a lot of things I can do. I can change the date, like right now it's on lifetime, so I can change to today, yesterday, all these things. And here I have all my campaigns present. I have all my ad sets and all my ads here as well. So right now it's a lot cluttery. So let me just uh, select one campaign so that we can analyze this one. And I'll go to filter by selection. So we can only see only this campaign. So only this campaign we can see right now. And within this campaign, there are two ad sets. Ad set one, Marvel ad set one, DC. So there are two ad sets and there are four ad sets in these two ad sets. So let me just uh, choose one of them. If I choose Marvel, then we, we can see that there are two ad sets, two ads in this ad set, in this Marvel ad set, okay? Also, you can see that there are everywhere this turn on, turn off buttons. You can turn on and turn off any ad or any ad set, or you can turn on this campaign as well. So all these options are present. And apart from that, you can see some information. You can see some columns like reach, frequency, impression, link clicks, click through rate, and all this information is there. CTR clicks, CPC, cost per click, a lot of information is there. And it's because the columns here, you can see the column is set to carousel engagement. If I set to performance, then you can see some different information as well. Here you can see bid strategy, budget, results, reach, cost per result, and some less information is there. But you can see the information changes, the columns changes as you can as you change the type of these columns. So I'll switch back to carousel engagement and you can see all this information is there. This is how you use ads manager. Now I'll show you how you can use the same on your mobile app. So here is Facebook ads application. You can see on your screen here on my mobile, I have Facebook ads application. It looks like this and now I'll open it and let me just turn it back. Yeah. So here you can see that this is my ad account. You can see Fatih Jeans ad account. You can change it by clicking here and you can select your ad account and here you can see that uh, there is again an option to change the date it's set to lifetime right now it, it, i can change to today yesterday or last seven days like that and here you can see account overview how much i've spent in this account how many people i've reached in this account and you can see all my campaigns like like i was looking at on the laptop so here you can see that the first campaign which we are looking at purchase campaign cold purchase campaign pack of three here if you want to see more about this campaign you have to click on this campaign and now you can see more detail has opened up and you can see next to results the column type is set to carousel engagement you can change it to any type of other engagement other type of metrics like you can change it to performance and now some other information will be present so i'll change back to carousel engagement because i like that information i like to have more information so you can see more information is there now so here you can see that there are two access just like we saw on the desktop marvel and dc and uh, once I click on Marvel, I'll see how many ads are there in this in this one. You can see how, how the Marvel campaign has performed, how the Marvel ad set has performed, sorry. And here you can see that uh, my two ads, ad one and ad two are present. So, and apart from that also gender, age, placement and location information is also available. You, you can't see it here right now because the information is a little less here. Once you run the campaign for a long time, then you will see more information. If you go to ad, then you can even see how the ad looks like, how the ad has performed. You can see all the results, carousel engagement it's set to, and all the information is here. And you can see how the ad looks like. And you can even click on preview all and look at how, how the ad will perform at different places on Instagram, on Facebook, like that. You can, here also you can see the buttons are always there. This turn on and turn off button, you can see I turned this one, this button on. It says campaign is off because I have, to, I have to turn on the campaign as well. But you can see this is how I can turn on and turn off the ad. So everything is available on the app as well and it's quite easy to use. So I hope that you like this video and uh, thank you for watching.